Okay, so for you two viewers, uh, we're doing a Moga double grass or double water ground. I'm more interested in the Pal World discussion I'm having with chat. So if you're not interested in this discussion, I'm so sorry, but this is very entertaining for me. Um, it's definitely a slippery argument for the Switch. I definitely think the game oh, was a tiny bit better, gym, so I have but time. didn't need to the most beautiful thing they put out. I really want the next Switch to be. That's the thing. Um, Pal World doesn't look beautiful. But it looks a whole lot fucking better than, um... Oh, I'm running quick attack. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. This I used this in Flying Cup. Oh, no. I forgot to take off quick attack. Oh, shit. I gotta put Thundershock on this boy. Um, I feel like Thunder Electric is doing good in this meta, so I wanted to try it. Um... Yeah, Power World is, is definitely a lot better looking than Scarlet Violet. The problem is that... Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Ooh, I didn't I think it's going to get to that so fast. The problem is that Pokemon has some unreal staying power that nothing could make a dent in money-wise. They will only change once they start to lose money. How that happens, who knows? You're right. Okay, I see your point. Pokemon is the biggest fucking franchise in the world. There's no way they're losing any money. Oh, I really wish I was Thundershock right now. <laughs> if I can make him two shield, this is nice. I don't know if Pal World is going to have enough a dent on Pokemon where they lose money. I really should have switched out to see if they had grass, by the way. I didn't even think about that. Who does better here? Swampert or Wish Cash? Like, Pal World is a, for Canadian, $40 game. I think for Americans, like, what, 35 And then maybe they'll do DLC or something. I don't know. And it's so weird to think about, because we all love Pokemon. Like, we don't like a company coming and fucking with, with Pokemon. But if it improves Pokemon, I do think it's a good thing. You know what I mean? I'm also fucked, by the way. <gasps> Get that. Should I keep it for Swampert? Ah, keep it for Swampert. Boom, 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 boom. Are you liking not having Stephen Holiday Cup? Whatever the cup was. Fantasy Cup? Yeah, I hated it. Um, same, Scarlet and Violet is one of my favorite Pokemon games from a story perspective. However, I do understand the frustration with people criticizing. I loved the story in Star Scarlet and Violet. The, the story in Scarlet Violet was good. I, I liked the whole, like, mother-daughter issues, or the, the the daddy issues that that one guy had. I'm fucked, and I lose. I just need something like Aqua Tail, please. There, there we go, for real. Probably has, like, 30 years of content. It'd be something screwing up Mario Silt. It's just not happening. So, Okay. I could agree with you. The Power World is probably not going to make a dent in... Can I...? No, I can't do anything. Okay, GG's. Power World is probably not going to make a dent in... Uh, in Pokemon. Which... Yeah. Like, the only way they would start improving things in Pokemon is if they were starting to lose money. And I don't see how, unless Power World starts making plush of every fucking character they have, and Power World makes Power World Unite, Power World Mystery Dungeon. Oh, God, I still didn't fucking change the move. That's gonna hurt. Power World Mystery Dungeon. Uh, what else does Pokemon have? Power Worlds. Go. Detective Pal World. <laughs> like, you you can't you can't Oh Jesus! <laughs> Amoga, calm the fuck down. <laughs> Pal World Snap. Yeah, like 30 years worth of Pal World movies. There's no way Pal World's gonna make a dent on it. Well, oh God, doesn't that bring up a bigger discussion? Like, all right, Sol, thank you for the raid. I'll talk to you later. Like, Nintendo kind of has a monopoly on this whole, like, fantasy creature 
um situation, right? I'm actually gonna swap into Swampert after this. Because uh uh Cust is better against Reggie. Step dungeon. Parallel TCG with hit. It's like how how could this new our world game it's a david and goliath situation really there's no way that power could compete with something that big and it's weird i have really weird feelings for for this situation because it's like we love pokemon i spend so much time playing pokemon pokemon is great we all love almighty pokemon but also they're kind of fucking rifing us for our love of childhood games they really do be manipulating us with like childhood stuff you know and it sucks and i don't know what to do here and i think i lose honestly mm, okay 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 so this doesn't kill him i shield once and if i can farm him down i really think he made a mistake here by going into this Oh, if I can get it before it hits. Perfect. Uh, oh, he done fucked up there. Yep. Yep. I love Pokemon also. Bandai makes Digimon better enough to challenge. That's true. Is Digimon... Is Bandai still making Digimon games? Closest thing ever came was Digimon, and that wasn't close. Yeah, that wasn't really close. But it was the closest. Nostalgia is when a hell of a drug in Nintendo's. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I'll have it. I'll hand it to the Nintendo. They really do know how to make themselves seem like a non-evil corporation. You know, like let's take Pokemon Go for instance. We're playing it right now. We all know Niantic does some sketchy stuff. Niantic purposely leaves out of like information in their events so we can spend more money. Niantic does some real bullshit stuff. It's not like their parent company is doing anything to stop it because Niantic is really raking it in for them. Wow, I wish I didn't have Thundershock right now. Fucking stupid. As soon as I take off Thundershock, Quick Attack was actually doing pretty good, I'm gonna be honest. Niantic is way worse than Nintendo. Yeah. But still, Ni Ni Nintendo has to have some hand in what they do, right? Niantic is borrowed a bit of trash. I feel like Pokemon running out of ideas for Pokemon designs. Nah, nah I disagree with that. I, th I still think there's some really good Pokemon designs in the newer games uh, can i get to the acrobatics uh there is just incompetent nintendo knows they're doing mouse hold a little mouse oh come on it's a cute little character for i like mouse hold wow amogo really fucked this guy jesus i like room i like um what's its name um martial martial law Tinko Tan <clears throat> Nantic probably pays Nintendo royalties um to use Pokemon trademark. I doubt Nintendo has yeah. Dunce Farce. Okay, they really fucked up with the Dunce Farce. I'll give you that rise. I hated that. Nintendo pretty much just tells them what they can and can't do with properly. I don't know why they swapped out immediately. Lantern absolutely wins that. That's it? Yeah, Lantern wins that. We both do neutral damage on each other. Imoka's really throwing these people for a loop. I don't know what's happening, but Imoka is just like existing and the opposing traders are like, oh god. <laughs> it's crazy. Um man paid actors for the set i promise i did it please give me the credit i deserve Ethan. don't say this shit i'm doing so well <laughs> i love ticketon too me too love me some ticketon after all those losses for the triple plan team yeah for sure i don't know man i i feel like pal world really like at the end of the day no matter what you feel about it or even if you know about it there's just, it definitely brings up a lot of discussion about Pokemon. I feel like 
people have been talking about and kind of maybe realizing and like almost hoping that whatever comes out of Power World, we just pray to God, maybe Pokemon developers will see what their game could be because this random developer came out of nowhere and made this amazing fantasy life creatures game and they did amazing with it and yeah i don't like the a lot of the ai designs i don't like a lot of stuff in it i wish they would pay real artists of course um and you know stealing the content is scummy because a lot of the pals look like pokemon but other than that i think i wish pokemon could be like this and maybe developers will see that and do something with their game we should have a Scrub Lord Dustin Pal World world. Would I be interested in that? Am I open like a Pal World Discord? Are we gonna play and shoot Pokemon together? I do think it's funny how some people refuse to play Pal World because of the AI stuff, but we'll play these AAA titles that have developers who are treated like absolute trust. Yeah! You know. <laughs> you have a point, Bardic. You have a point. I will say there is some hypocrisy going on. Um, because there's, there is a lot of AAA games where the uh, designers are just not treated fairly at all. And people will still play those games, you know. I don't know. A lot of discussion. A lot of discussion breeding from Pal World. Definitely. They have such tight deadlines for their main series games. They need more higher devs. Actually finished. I don't know what it's like for Pokemon developers. Does anyone have the scoop? Because I know Pokemon is rushed out all the time. I did two shield flex that and I should probably make that like a thumbnail. Hey Mocha, two shield flexes on this trainer. Um... I know Pokemon developers are like, are they fucking poop out games? I wonder if they are. This is my TED talk, Mark. Leave it alone. I wonder if they are rushed. Does he have two disarming voices? Can they have two? Can you stack two disarming voices? I hope not. I don't think you can, right? I wish Pokemon would take a page from Zelda. We just like, honestly, if I had it my way, if I had it my way, I would just be like, yo, take the Breath of the Wild world and put Pokemon in it. Just just do that. Do it right now. <laughs> I don't fucking care what legal stuff it, it infringes on. So fucking take that beautiful Breath of the Wild world. Also put Kirby in it. Also put Mario Karts in it. Do it. We'll give you a million dollars. Oh my god, I just realized there's a Meganium. Oh, and put Pikmin in it. Yes. Meganium. Meganium loves Pikmin. Oh, if I can have a Meganium Pikmin game. Some Meganiums and maybe a blue Pikmin. And a green Pikmin and a red Pikmin. And some Meganiums. Yeah, no attack drops. I'd never get attack drops, bro. Never get attack drops. That's how the environment seems. From the info we have, they have few people for the massive franchise that it is. That's why the games are always buggy from post. Probably should have shielded Emolga there. Ooh, probably should have shielded Emolga there. It wouldn't have mattered. I would have lost anyways. McGinnim just raw dogged me. <sighs> Okay, three wins. Amoga. Amoga got some good battles, I'm not gonna lie. Really, f people just like saw it and were kind of fucking scared. Which is awesome. Oi. Okay. But I'm gonna be honest, you guys, I'm not doing 10 battles. And I thought about it. I thought about going live for 10 battles, but. You know, I also post these videos on YouTube and I do them unedited now. So I really don't want to be posting videos where I'm like exhausted. I don't want to do 10 battles because 
by battle six or five i'm exhausted so i'm gonna end it here and i'm gonna play unite so those of you that hate pokemon unite i'll see you in the next stream make sure you check out the youtube videos we'll do like annihilate first and i'll have to think of like some clever thumbnail about it being weird you know and like glitched out and everything okay you heard dustin everyone get out <laughs> Mark loves that. Mark loves when I fucking transition the Pogo to Unite. <laughs> because I'm basically like, yeah, I'm done Pogo, guys. Y'all can leave. But thank you for the, you, thank you for everyone for